Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Madison and Christian here. Today we're officially starting the second half of Loki season two. Last episode, we did see that the loom is still in trouble. It's still overloading, uh, but Loki and Mobius went and grabbed a He Who Remains variant, Victor Timely. So hopefully his aura will be able to fix the loom or something like that. Uh, but it's been a wild season so far. We're definitely hyped for episode four. Thank you guys so much for joining us today. Let's do it. Let's do it. Whoa. Whoa. What is going on? Oh, we're on the timeline. What is this? Just watch. Oh, Whoa. she can play it back all small like that? That's so cool. So it's almost ready. Oh, it's them. I would be proud to leave with you. You made a difference in this war. Thank you for being on my team. Oh, she helped him defeat the Kangs? Hmm. I'll catch up. It's been a long road. See you soon. This is before their minds were erased, I guess. That's what I'm thinking. Not today. Pull up protocol 42. It's like order 66? Right. Erase her memories. Damn. Wow. Yeah, now it makes sense why his statue was in the past, but they don't remember. Exactly. That we don't need him. Maybe we never did. They want to take over? Just them two? <laughs> Maybe. I'm sure they could run it. They practically were, you know? What do you feel? He's only read about it. Right. Why isn't anybody with him? I was going to say, he's just walking around. I thought Loki and Mobius were right behind. That's what I thought. Yeah. Hello. There they are. Listen, Professor, I can only imagine what Renslayer and Miss Minutes have been saying about us, but it's not true. Unless I said something good. <laughs> <laughs> In which case it is. The effervescent clock lady monster thing wants me. I, I should have some say. I don't disagree. Ooh, but... We don't really have time to talk about it, though. Or I will, and I did, almost, way. you, but not you. But can't we just... Take a, take a look. Trust me, it's not that no. great. And we don't have time. And we don't have time. We've adjusted everything we can adjust. He's going to recognize him. You think from so? The, yeah, from the handbook. Remember oh, yeah. Oh, B? Yeah, you're right. Ouroboros. <laughs> he fangirled. But I learned everything I know from a brilliant 19th century inventor named Victor Timely. If he had resources, that's I'm crazy. Shut <laughs> up. They're fangirling each other. Each other. <gasps> so if your work is based on his work and his work. <laughs> your work. <laughs> right, yeah. <laughs> Inscribe mine. <laughs> That's the second time he's given <laughs> he's an like, autograph. Would you sign mine? Yes. <laughs> the way you explain the electric bypass system. Bypass. Poetry, just poetry. Guys, sorry to... It's beautiful. To give the shoddy and slapdash work, uh, it's not to scale. I only got one coat of paint on there. <laughs> They're like, it's fine. It's literally great. Blue. I'm honestly embarrassed that Victor is here to see it. <laughs> the rings of the loom aren't wide enough. That's correct. We need to make the rings bigger so more branches. Can, fit can fill through, yeah. Much more temporal radiation out here than there was when you went out there, Mobius. Yeah, so much more. So it'll hurt whoever goes out there? I mean, Loki's really gonna have to hook it then, right? <laughs> you volunteered him? Because it's your turn. He's like, I already did it and risked my skin. <laughs> yeah. But this person just needs to be super fast. Okay, great. So what are we waiting for? Well, 
maybe Victor will want to do it. It's his loom. Every time, yeah. How did you know that? Because I have seen. Is that the piece? With my loom. <gasps> oh. Until I made this. That's why he wanted to go back for it. Mm. Mr. Ouroboros, if anyone can. It's you. Yes. Gassing him up. Yes. Damn, that's crazy. So he knew his loom wasn't going to work at the convention. He yeah. only did it just to raise money. And yeah. that piece was safe back in his lab. Everything is turning to shit. And you want to leave it to them while we go and have some pie. I mean, we'll just get in the way. <laughs> you found out you're a variant and you haven't even looked, have you? It's just another bad day at the office for you. I'm so curious as to where he's from. But I know you care about the TVA. And I know you want to protect it. That's the only reason I'm here. But I care about this place, these people. So do you. Trust that. I think they can trust her. Yeah, I think they so literally, too. They don't have any other lives than this, you know? Mm-hmm. Got to. took a wrong turn she ended up in the pie room <laughs> <laughs> you spared timely's life and because of that the tva and those timelines will survive those people will survive you yeah spared their lives too she did more good by saving him mm -hmm. it would just be easier to burn this place down and start from scratch sure burn it down easy annihilating is easy raising things to the ground is Fixing things is hard. Yeah. It sounds like whatever we do, we're playing God. Well, it kind of just fell into their laps. They didn't ask for it. You right. Know? We are gods. I was just about to say that. Yeah. Oh, true. Yeah. yeah well, I don't trust B-15. So I... Oh shit, what is this? <gasps> no. no. She's setting in place her plan to control the TVA. But if we work together, we can stop her. Oh, great. Well, what's your plan then? Anyone who joins me right here, follows me out that door, will have a life on the timeline if they want it. Oh, he's in <laughs> immediately. That's all he wants. Will the rest of them care? I thought you could see the bigger picture. Oh, he's gonna take that deal. She doesn't want just him, though. Oh, no. For the first time, I finally am seeing the bigger picture. Damn. Life in the timeline was that good, huh? <gasps> oh no. She's gonna crush them all. Are you kidding me? No. Oh Miss my Minutes God. is loving it. Miss Minutes is bloodthirsty. Oh yeah. You better go lay in that bed that you just made. And was that his mom or something? I or... don't know, but they seemed like they had a really close relationship. In episode one, right? Yeah. This little Mobius picked me up, courtesy of the hot cocoa machine. Has he never had it? M machine? Yeah. This temp pad's not working. Mobius? Yeah. Can I see the temp pad? You have a machine. He's more hyped about that. <laughs> right. Is there like blood everywhere? I don't know. I thought maybe they would have like just disappeared, but like they're not showing us the out the room for a reason, you know? Yeah. <gasps> oh, that's why the temp pads aren't working. <laughs> He's real hyped about this. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <gasps> 
Oh, what? From behind? <gasps> oh, no. Something's still messing with this thing. I mean, yours wasn't working either. She's doing the uh 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 thing like yeah. Jurassic Park. Docs and her team are dead. What? It's got to be Rensselaer. Yeah. Dude. Send a friend. I, I don't know what the vice you're jabbering on about. Sit. He's like, oh, you. <laughs> and you. He's like, great. <laughs> then X5 here gonna find a very thorough and incredibly painful way to kill you it's a very small box oh oh come on come on come on come on oh is this when it happens when he sees her in the future like is it now huh because remember the elevator wasn't working mm -hmm. <gasps> look they just got split up yeah I just hate that clock she's trying to slow us down take the stairs That's why she said, there you are. Yeah, because they were together before she got on the elevator. Pretty tech savvy. Nice. Yeah, this is it. Come on. <gasps> it is him. But look, he has a stick. Oh, yep. It's going to be him. Dog, it all comes full circle. Yep. That's wild. So he saved himself. Yeah. <laughs> He's like, here I am. I promise you this will make sense. <gasps> Who's on the phone? Yeah. Hello? Now time, what's taking you guys so long? OB. Oh, it was OB? What are we gonna lose? The security protocols will go down. Like what? The dampeners that prevent people from using magic at the TVA. Turn it off! Literally, that would help so much. They could use their magic again. Yeah. Someone's trying to reboot the system. I can't hear that. Oh, she's glitching. Well, marking this just isn't necessary. There oh. He thought she was mocking his yeah. stutter. <laughs> Whoa. You'll never be him. <gasps> oh. What? Oh, he doesn't know they can use their magic again. Mm-hmm. What do you say, X5? Fancy a rematch. Ooh, let's go. A full-fledged Loki, let's go. <gasps> oh. They're gonna control him? Maybe. <gasps> oh. What? That was so dope. I'm so glad they reboot the system. Was that Sylvie? Yeah. Oh, she like controlled his mind, I yeah. guess. Yeah. Uh, just put your head in the scanner. Put your head? Is that safe? <laughs> it should be. Welcome, he who remains. Oh, look at that. It did work. I was worried it wouldn't. I was too. Who's it gonna be? I'll do it. I'll put the suit on. Could he go fast with his magic? Perhaps it can make him faster. That's what I was thinking. No, you don't. Now he wants to go? How long will he have? Not long. Don't make it. I don't know about these radiation levels because it's even worse than when I was don't out there. Don't make it. True. And when Mobius was out there, the suit deteriorate, deteriorated like really quickly. I know. Come on, let's go, let's go. Come on, let's move. Oh, come on, Victor Timely, you got it. 
Let's go. What? What the fuck happened? Where is he? He's gone. What happened? It's over. How did that happen? Temporal radiation is just too hot. It was the radiation? It just ripped him apart that quickly? I can't believe that. That's crazy. Oh, oh shit. Wait, what's happening? That's it? <gasps> oh, what? Whoa, bro. There's still two more episodes. Wow. I can't believe that. I, first of all, was not expecting that to happen to Victor Timely. So does that mean the thing that they made, the throughput multiplier, it's gone too? It looked like it fell. Okay. But, but it, doesn't, doesn't it doesn't matter. Like it literally doesn't even matter at this point. And Renslayer got pruned? Pruned, yeah. But I don't know if that's the last we're gonna see of her. Well, we were right about a few things. Uh, a few episodes ago, we said we thought it was possible that Loki from the future was the one who pruned uh, Loki, well, the past Loki when he went to the future. When he right? eventually got there, yeah. he was the one that pruned himself. Pruned himself. And we, and we only got to that conclusion because of Sylvie. The way she reacted when she saw him. When she saw him, she was like, there you are. There you are. So yeah. it's like they were there together mm -hmm. at that point. So yeah, that was pretty cool to see. Um, I was kind of expecting it to work um, for, you know, like Victor Timely's aura. I was kind of expecting that to work. But at the end, I was not expecting like any of that. I really thought we were actually gonna manage the timeline, you know? I thought there might be some twist that maybe Victor Timely was he who remains, like they're the same guy. Mm -hmm. But no, it really seems that he really was just a variant if he died right here, you know? Oh, true. Another thing we were right on is that um, he who remains wiped everybody's memories at some point. Yeah. Yeah. Now, nah. Honestly, I had no idea Renslayer was one of the people that helped him during the multiversal war mm. when he was fighting against all of himself. So that's really awful. I mean, she definitely got betrayed by him. I wonder for what reason he would turn on her like that. I don't know. It seems like he wanted to be at the end of time alone, but then why even but then when, somebody on? When Loki and Sylvie showed up, he was kind of like, oh, I, like I'm happy to see somebody else for once. You right, know? and it's almost like he planned this to happen. He could have, the, the two of them could have just ruled together at the end of time forever, like they were talking about. Mm -hmm. Like, I don't know why he chose to go that route. Maybe we'll find out why. In the next two episodes? Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right, guys, that's gonna do it for this one. This was definitely a crazy episode and we were not expecting it to end like this. But we're really excited to get to the last two episodes. So if you want to catch that and all the other shows are watching, you know what to do. Hit that like button and subscribe because it definitely helps out our channel. Follow our Instagram for some extra content from us. And real quick, we did want to make a shout out to our newest Patreon supporters, Brady, Gabe, Aaron, and Treadmill. You guys are the greatest along with all of our other supporters. Now, real quick, guys, one more thing before we go, we did want to mention that our Patreon movie of the month was Raid Redemption. We definitely had a blast watching the movie. It was very intense and it'll be exclusively on our Patreon. So if you'd like to support the channel, get an extra movie reaction and vote on our next movie, we'll leave a link for our Patreon down below. But as always, you guys are the greatest and we'll catch you in the next one. Peace out, guys. Bye.